What's going on everybody, it's your boy Drew, and today I'm going to show you guys how you can transfer your Animal Crossing New Horizons Island data between two switches. It doesn't matter which switch platforms you're using, whether it be a switch or a switch Lite. Uh, other than that, there is not much to it. So what you're going to need is you're going to need your switch devices, you're going to need the serial number of your original device, which will be on the bottom portion of your switch. Uh, it doesn't matter switch or switch light. And then you are also going to need a uh, saved backup file for your Animal Crossing New Horizons uh, Island. And if you don't know how to do that, I'm about to show you. So open up Animal Crossing if you haven't already. And then press uh, the minus button to get into your settings. And then once you do that, Nook will come up and he'll have a little bit of dialogue. And then I'm not going to disable this setting because I already have it set, but I'm going to show you what you should do. So right here, here this third option, it'll say um, if you already have it enabled, it say island back. And, and in that case, you're all set. You're good to go. If it doesn't, then it'll say enable island backup. And then that's, that's what you're going to want to do. And then Nook will explain that the purpose of this is for when your switch is lost or stolen and you need your island data that it'll be backed up to the Nintendo servers, which is uh, important for what we're trying to do. And then this save data right here is if you want to manually save your uh, save data um, to the backup. So the reason we need this is because um, each Animal Crossing island is unique to the Switch. You can't have more than one island per Switch, unfortunately, based off of the current updates. Uh, that they have, and Nintendo also released that they were going to fix this, however, they haven't yet. So, we're, this is the only current workaround or solution that we know of. So anyways, once you're done with that, you're going to want to call Nintendo, um, and I'm going to leave the website for Nintendo and I'm going to leave the customer service number in the description of this video for you to call. And all you have to do once you hop on there, it's basically this is how the station is going to um, They're going to automate a voice message system. is going to ask you a bunch of different menus, walk through a bunch of different menus. And then you're going to uh, speak to a live agent. And then um, the next thing after that is you just tell them what you need. So you want to transfer your switch. Uh, island, Animal Crossing Island data between uh, switch devices. You know, I didn't have to give a, I didn't have to give an explanation for why I wanted to, but I've seen a couple of other YouTube videos where they said, "Oh, I spilt coffee on it" or something like that. You can do whatever. I mean, the person wasn't too mad at me, or he didn't seem mad. <laughs> and then, uh, so they'll walk you, they'll walk you through it. They'll ask you for that serial number for your original device, and uh, they'll ask you to make sure that you have whatever game uh this uh animal crossing on your uh new device right and then they'll have you load up and they'll walk you through the rest of the uh procedure which i can't show you right now unless i actually unless i actually go through the process myself but when you load up animal crossing uh instead of getting the new welcome screen with timmy and tommy you're going to be met with uh if he's going to instruct or they on the phone are going to instruct you to hold the minus button down when you see the uh, black Nintendo screen before the uh, welcome screen or uh, the Nooks, the Nook brothers greet you. And then um, Nook will appear and he'll ask you if you want to redeem or upload or download. Sorry. Yeah. He'll ask you if you want to download your save data file. And uh, then the operator, whoever's on the phone, should be able to walk you through the rest. Um, if you have any questions for me, please leave them down in the comments. I know this uh, video was kind of brief, but um, this is currently the only working method until they get an update or a patch for this. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like and subscribe, and peace.